gonna do now? Hey, I know you. You're Eret's bodyguard. I could really use her help. She always knew where to find the best herbs, and... You haven't seen her, have you? I used up all my meds treating people injured when the plate fell, you see. I could make more, but not without those herbs. So, what do you need? You mean you're willing to help me out? Oh, thank you. You'd be doing this town a huge favor. Here's a list of everything I'm looking for. glad I caught you. Sam, he told me who you are. Said you're a merc and a former soldier at that. Listen, I hate to ask, but we got a few runaway birds. Mind helping us find them? Poor things were so startled by that plate coming down, they just up and bolted. I'm sure they're around here somewhere, frightened and hungry. <sighs> My poor birds. Worried about them, huh? Alright, I think we can help you out. Oh. Thank you. When you find them, feed them this. There's three missing all told, and their names are Coco, Lolo, and Momo. They'll come on home once they got some food in their bellies. Good luck. I'm counting on y'all. It's you, my good Merc! What brilliant timing you have! Oh, hello there. It is a pleasure to meet you both. I'm a journalist for The Daily Buzz. The Daily Buzz? You mean that trash filled with Shinra fluff pieces? Well, yes, that's fair. But we do get a lot of inside information because of our close ties with the company. <laughs> Curious? Here's the scoop. A certain division of Shinra, that shall remain nameless, was planning to seize Corneo's assets. But before they could, the key to his secret vault, within which his misbegotten gains were securely tucked away, was stolen. And my sources tell me that the thief is the Undercity's beloved hero, the Angel of the Slums! The unidentified bandit who's been targeting anyone with ties to Shinra or Corneo. Yes! That Angel of the Slums has struck again! Well, do I have your undivided attention now? Kinda, but hurry it up. We don't have time for a three-act play. Then I'll make this quick. So, my good Merc, you do remember where the Angel's hideout is, right? Do you remember the death threat she left there? Oh, that. I've decided to seek the silver lining in this case. If the Angel of the Slums deigns to take an interest in a humble reporter, then that itself would be a story. <sighs> what are you asking? If you recover the stolen key, feel free to help yourself to the contents of Corneo's vault. All I want is knowledge, the identity of the angel. So if you happen to learn anything of value, I'd be tremendously grateful to you if you passed it along. Where's everyone else? Well, we saw a bunch of tombstones lying on the ground, so we decided to stand them back up. And then I heard laughing coming from somewhere, and when I turned around, everyone was gone. I was alone. Bat! 
I heard that, and everyone disappeared. Heads up! Don't overdo it. Ooh, this is my turn! Ooh, it. Gotta love it! I'm waiting. People are counting on you. Keep going in. Bring it! This way. This is where our parents are. They're resting, but we wanted to say hi. Sometimes you just want to do that, you know? I do. Thanks so much for coming to find us. That's another one I owe you. We're gonna head back to the house now. Ms. Foley is probably pretty worried. Hey, Cloud, I found this on the ground. You should take it. I think it might come in handy. Bunch of little smart asses. <laughs> With good hearts.
Bang, bang! You're up! is there. Good job. Whatever, man. Let's go. Ain't nothing to worry about. Yes, not a bit. Good sweat. Johnny's been hacked. 
Bro! Tifa! Damn, is it good to see you guys again? I told you to stop calling me that. Bro, I'm in serious need of your expertise. Lend me a hand! Fine. What? Truth is, I'm, uh, trying to get out of town for, uh, reasons. Yeah, reasons. But the thing is... <laughs> I got mugged! She took it! Took it all, man! <sighs> I tried to chase her down, I really did! But she was real fast-like! Man, what am I gonna do? This could be the end for old Johnny boy! I'm begging you, help me out! Come on, bro! <sighs> What'd she look like? Bro! Uh, hold on. Let me think. I wanna get this right. She was a cutie. Black hair. Pretty sure she was wearing a hat. And, uh, oh yeah! She was wearing these striped stockings, too. Kyrie? Which way'd she go? Uh, toward the church, I think. Hey there, man. You into music? I screwed up an order of discs, sitting on a mountain of them now. Mind taking at least one off my hands? Please, please be alive. If I knew this was gonna happen, I would've... Say... Ain't nothing to worry about. <laughs> What? It wasn't me! You've got the wrong girl! Never committed a crime in my life! You Kyrie? Uh, Kyrie? Who's that? Can't say I know her, but cool name. <laughs> Someone mugged our friend and took every last skill he had. Sound familiar? Oh, that? <laughs> oh, I thought I was in actual trouble. Don't scare me like that. Now I remember you. You're that chick. The one who was spreading lies in Sector 5. I did do that. <laughs> good times, good times. <gasps> Hold on. I know you, Blondie. You're that merc everyone's talking about. 
Huh, maybe my luck's not so bad. Shinra's after me. You've got to help me. So from them too, did you? No. Well, yes, sorta. Of. It's complicated. How was I supposed to know they were Shinra? And now those jerks won't leave me alone. Even though all I took was some ugly key. I mean, what's the big deal anyway? Wait a minute. That was you? <sighs> oh, great. So everyone's talking about it? <laughs> Is this the end? Am I a dead woman? Do I have to go in the run? <laughs> Leave Midgar forever and, and never look back? Kyrie, please. Just give us the money you stole from our friend, would you? And the key while you're at it. No way! You're gonna split the second I do! And then who will protect me? I can't handle this on my own! <sighs> we'll handle Shinra if you give us the key. Deal? It's a deal! Right about now, those Shinra creeps should be hanging out at the Colosseum. They're waiting for a special match to start, starring yours truly. It's the talk of the town. You're joking. Oh, I won't be there. I'm not stupid. It's a miracle you've managed to stay alive this long. I'll take that as a compliment. Now run along and clean up my mess. Do this fast. I'll do that. Need my help. You got this. Hang back. Ah. Steady. You ready? Let's do this.
Bring it. It's on you. Death is not Let's make this. Put you in your place. Keep it together. About damn time.
deal with that. Fuck on me! You got 
got this! Sweat. Okay, then that makes three. We better check in at Sam's. My babies are all back home, safe and sound. Now I can finally get back to the business of business. Thanks, partner. Here, y'all earn this. It's a pass that'll get you a ride on one of my carriages whenever you need it. Free of charge, of course. Not bad, am I right? Chocobos or something else. You can ride them, pet them, befriend them. What would we do without them? They're the reason a guy like me can keep a roof over his head in a town like this. And that's no lie. <laughs> I wouldn't blame you for doubting that coming from me, but it is what it is. Do we really have to deal with Corneo again? Got no other choice. What? Did you guys get into it with him or something? I don't want to talk about it. Huh? Hey, Cloud! What happened? Don't recall. Everyone's so sad. Ping, ping. Everyone's so sad. Ping, ping. Everyone. Oh, hey, yeah. Daddy, I'm so glad to see you're okay. You too. Uh, where's Marlene? Is she okay? Don't worry. She's safe. Really? I'm so glad. Hey, can you help me with something? I'm looking for music discs for the jukebox. I think some new music might cheer people up, make them happy. That's a wonderful idea. Okay. If we find any music discs, we'll bring them straight to you. You just promised to crank up the volume, all right? You know I will. Thanks! You hear? You're done. Oh, I guess I'm 
lot more people made it out than I thought. <sighs> There's nothing quite like kicking back and letting the music flow through you. What's that? You want to get in on my flow? Oh. You're all set for seven. Can't believe our luck. Thought for sure we'd be able to meet the time. Now, now, it's still early. Might be he's asleep. Are you sure you're okay with this? I mean, what choice do we have? And we'll be set for life if he picks me for his bride. Pivot is in cloud. We're looking for a way topside. No one? Good luck with that. Security's so tight these days that not even a gnat could slip through. Walmart gets in a sorry state, too. Corneo's men are turning it upside down looking for Avalanche. Hmm? The man with a gun for an arm. What? Got a problem? No, but you might. Corneo's men are searching high and low for an avalanche member who fits your description. Shinra has placed a very impressive bounty on you and your friends' heads. And a lot of people are looking to get rich. Ain't these fools got anything better to do? You should also know that you and that arm of yours were spotted in the Sector 5 slums. Apparently, you were loitering in a rather lovely flower garden. Oh, yeah? Wait. This is bad. Really bad. Let's move. What do you say? Want to go to Sector 7? I found when I was cleaning out my closet. Wanna take one off my hands? 